Today's horoscope, Sagittarius March 16, 2022. Discover your future with my daily horoscope for you about love, work, health, money and compatibility with other signs. Today is powerful for creative inspiration and love matters, even if it gets off to a rocky start. Doubts seem to fade away as the day advances. It's an excellent time for recognizing patterns of behavior or patterns in your past that are contributing to your current situation. Problems are a little easier to solve as you look at the big picture instead of analyzing details. Your sense of harmony and balance is vital today, and this can help you create plans that truly work for you. You might attract others through your confidence in expressing your unique qualities. Your Love Horoscope are you and your sweetheart on the same page with regards to your long-term goals and general belief systems? Single, crushing, or already smitten in love, the moon's journey through Leo via your expansive ninth house of adventure, faith, and unknown territory brings greater emphasis to themes surrounding your personal vistas and philosophies, but in opposition to restrictive Saturn via your curious communication sector is simultaneously challenging you to speak your truth. Granted, it's not always fun working through the shadowy stuff, but you're also in the process of solidifying the foundation of your connection. It's all happening as it should. Your Career Horoscope Go after your journey with enthusiasm. Now is the time to have some fun with your professional development, especially with the moon in joyful Leo. You could feel called to go all in with a trip or an educational opportunity to further your career path. But before you jet off, lean into the lunar opposition with Saturn in Aquarius. Get excited about what you could do or where your career could go. But use the opposition to remain somewhat level-headed when assuming responsibility for your next adventure. In other words, look before you leap. Your Finance Horoscope what a difference a few days can make. It was just two days ago that the moon not only left your financial sector, but clashed with Pluto in your income sector before leaving. Now, as the moon not only returns to your career sector, but to begin the lead up to a full moon, a friendly aspect to Pluto is just part of the positive energy this is going to generate across the income, work and career fronts. Social life today. You are in a state of siege in your own home and in your family circle. People are criticizing you constantly and you feel you're doing everything wrong. Take time to reflect before retorting because they could actually be right on some points. If you react in a sober way, your family will regain their trust in you very quickly. Your dating horoscope. Show off a little. People need to see what you can do. This is a great time for it too. Your good energy is practically overflowing, so you should be able to work magic or very nearly. Flirting tips. You find the idea of meeting new people difficult, not really something you want to contemplate. If this is actually how you feel, then far better to wait a while and reflect on what you really want to achieve. When this is done, the idea of dating has a realistic purpose with much higher chances for success. Lucky numbers, 7, 10, 17, 27, 44. Your well-being horoscope. A hot under the collar feeling might plague you today. Working out your own health regimen is very challenging. There is an initial phase of voices inside the head saying things like, feed me ice cream, or I will hate you, and I'm too tired to exercise. With practice you will learn to calm them down with, you will feel better, and it won't take that long, and I'd rather you eat this fruit salad with fresh raspberry sauce. Yum! Your daily numeroscope. You can bet that someone in your family will be on your mind today. This is almost unavoidable when there is a vibration in the air. Rather than trying to distract your thoughts, why not make some plans to visit and share time with this person? Even if the reason they're on your mind is because there's a problem between you, take the time to see if you can't work things out. Express your feelings and do all that you can to bring some resolve. Daily Planetary Overview 
There are no major transits happening today. The energy in the cosmos heightens our intuition and gives us the capacity to dream bigger and better. All of the water energy swarming around in the sky might make us feel a little more emotional than usual, which isn't uncommon during Pisces season. Rather than get swept up in your emotions, allow yourself to release your feelings by writing a letter to the universe or others expressing your sentiments. The more you get them out there, the easier it will be to navigate through the day. If you have a vision that you want to get off the ground, now is a great time to manifest the project. Don't be shy about stating what you want to accomplish. The universe is looking out for you now and giving you the intuition to know what needs to be done to complete the task at hand. Trust your gut feelings today. They can help you exceed your expectations. There is magic in the air, and you can catch it and make it reality. The temptations could be to poke holes in others' beliefs that we find ridiculous or untrue. Keep your opinions to yourself right now. It won't do any good to argue about this today. Also be careful about telling yourself a negative narrative. That way of thinking will be very hard to avoid. However, show people they can count on you and you'll earn points with them that will last long into the future. Sky for today. In the pre-dawn hours, the Leo moon opposes Saturn in Aquarius, inclining us to moodiness or depression. We may be literally isolated from loved ones or otherwise feel there is an emotional wall preventing others from seeing or hearing us. This influence will pass relatively quickly. In the meantime, we might brainstorm ways to better connect with our own inner authority. What steps could we take to embrace our capabilities and competency? The moon then enters a void of course lasting until tonight. Avoid starting projects and let the natural flow of the day take its course. In the early afternoon, the moon forms a quinkings to the Pisces sun, signaling distractions. We aim to demonstrate compassion and empathy towards others, yet in the back of our minds, we want credit for our good deeds. We may feel confused, questioning whether we can truly be selfless and altruistic if there is nothing in it for us. However, there's nothing wrong with desiring acknowledgement for a job well done. Wanting attention doesn't make us bad people, and by conflating altruism with asceticism, we deny the power we have as individuals to affect positive change in the lives of others. If you are awake before the sun, treat yourself like royalty by staying in your cozy bed. Or if you're up early, treat yourself to an elaborate breakfast, ideally made by someone else. There's an early morning Moon-Jupiter opposition that can transmit good feelings and the desire to be super generous and kind, but the more nice gestures you make the more attention you get, which is something that you probably won't want during this aspect. You like doing things for others now because it makes you feel good, not because you want to be recognized for it, and the more thanks you get the more it actually lessens your experience. But don't try to overcomplicate things too much now,